Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, folks. Michael Zuber, one rental at a time. And as I mentioned in my daily financial news this morning, I had an extra special guest coming on at 11 o'clock Pacific. Here he is. Uh, let's welcome Paul Miller to the show. How are you doing, Paul? Good, good. Hi, Mike. Hey, man. Um, yeah. So thank you for this. Uh, people don't know Paul. Paul is somebody I am working with in Fresno, California. Uh, Paul was recommended to me by a good friend of mine, Brad Hardy. And really what I wanted Paul to come here to talk about is building an ADU, specifically in Fresno. It'll apply to California and maybe other parts of the country. But uh, Paul, why don't you kind of introduce who you are and the company you, you work with, work for, and uh, we'll, we'll get rolling from there. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'm Paul Miller. Um, I'm an architect. Uh, my firm is the Vernal Group. Um, and we do a mixture of all different types of projects, don't really specialize. Um, which makes it a little more interesting and yeah. get to work on ADUs and little tiny, little tiny houses and, and a little bit bigger and all the way up to medical uh, clinics, um, uh, um, community centers, uh, educational, uh, industrial, all, all different types of projects. So um, yeah, just all different sizes and types. Yeah, this is really cool. And again, folks, if you're following this channel for any length of time, you know my story is buy and hold. I started doing flipping once I quit. But I have a, a special place in my heart for affordable housing. I grew up, you know, in, in that kind of environment. And, you know, I, I now can look at my portfolio and I have some units that I picked up over the last couple of decades that kind of always look like they could support another home, right? The house was built back. It's a full 10,000 foot square lot. It, to me, it's always like, hey, someday I'm going to build one there. So uh, Paul has been gracious enough to work with me on a property. I'll just call it Pine Street uh, that we bought actually during the housing crash. Uh, it's a two bedroom, one and a half bath house. I think it's like 950 square feet. It might be 980, something like that. But it's built way back on the city lot. So I came to Paul and I said, Paul, what do you think? Can I build an ADU on this? And, and that was kind of the conversation, right? That's how we started this. Yep, that's it. Yeah. yeah. And it's a, yeah, it's a unique lot there. Of course, uh, you know, every lot is a little bit unique, but that one kind of has a, the streets wrapping all the way around it. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's kind of yeah. odd. And again, folks, as you'll know, on this channel, I talk about the good and the bad, right? So I had a conversation with Paul and Paul was wonderful to deal with. And he goes, hey, the law allows for you to build up to, I think it was 1,250 square feet as a second unit or second dwelling. Is that yeah, depending on the lot size, but uh, yeah, your, your, your lot would, uh, you could do that. Yeah, and again, this is why you work with professionals that are in the business. So he came to back to me and he said, hey, you know, you could build 1,250 square feet. You got to remember folks, I came to Paul going, hey, I want to build a, I want to build a tiny house. And this is my first mistake. Paul says, you can build up to 1,250. I'm like, ooh, 1250, I could build a three bedroom, two bath house, right? Forget tiny houses. So, uh, you know, that's kind of where we started. And uh, I just want to show folks, I actually took a screenshot of what you helped design for me, which was awesome. Uh, so I don't know, Paul, if you can see this now, hopefully it's coming up on your screen. I don't know if you can see it or not. Yeah, it's uh, the... Uh... It's essentially the first design you did for me, right? My house is in the back on pine. And then you built a great art, you know, art tech, it's something that fits on the lot as a three bedroom, two bath house. Yeah. Right. Oh, there yeah. he is. Yeah. I mean, somehow my, my connection had to get restarted. So. <laughs> That's okay. We, I think we're doing okay. So again, what you did for me is you built, you, you, you designed as an architect would a three bedroom, two bath house that would fit on that lot. Um, Correct. Yeah. So then yeah, what I very, very, very efficient, uh, mm -hmm. you know, straightforward, but I uh, have. Nope. Looks like I lost Paul. Hmm. Nope. Did I lose you? I think I lost you there for a second. Yeah, yeah, it's, I'm back. I see you now. I, I don't yeah. know why it's disconnecting. Yeah, um, 